Hello everyone welcomes to my sister wives today today channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Following his death, Garrison Brown's family intends to keep his legacy alive through a Hawaiian apparel brand. Garrison Brown, the son of Cody and Janelle Brown, committed suicide in his Flagstaff, Arizona, home one month ago. The Flagstaff Police Department determined that the 25-year-old man's death was a suicide, according to the U.S. Sun. The National Guard veteran's roommate said in the police report that the U.S. son was able to get that he had previously battled depression and alcohol addiction. When things went south is unknown, but it is known that he was an entrepreneur who, with his brother Gabe's assistance, opened up shop in 2020 as Bob's Floral, selling clothes in the Hawaiian style. Robert Garrison Brown, better known by his birth name Garrison, said on the brand's Instagram page a few months after its introduction that Bob's Floral will be temporarily on pause. My reopening strategy is huge, but it will take time to implement. I hope Bob's Floral's items are manufactured in the United States with love and care for people who want a carefree existence. Until then, we hope you continue to follow and support the page, he said in closing. I sincerely appreciate your support, everyone. It can now be confirmed exclusively by the U.S. Sun that Bob's Floral LLC is still operational and in good standing. Furthermore, his family intends to carry on with his intentions with the apparel brand, according to a source. A close family friend of the sister wives told the U.S. Sun he was definitely planning on working on his clothing, but before his death, he wasn't really doing much of anything, truthfully. He was depressed and was unhappy and he didn't feel like he was getting much success from anything. By wasn't really any announcements of any plans coming, the insider continued, alluded to a relaunch. But now, oddly enough, there's conversations within the family about how they're going to try to keep his legacy alive. They plan on carrying on some of his dreams, which can be done by his brothers, they said. The family is working on creating a foundation for him, according to the source, and since animal rescue is a cause near and dear to his heart, it may be focused on it. The source went on, they're going to turn what happened into a positive. Along with Garrison and Gabe, Janelle and her ex-partner Cody are parents to four more children, Logan, Maddie, Hunter, and Savannah. To celebrate Garrison's memory, the TLC family got together on March 24 at the Clark County Armory in Las Vegas, Nevada. Garrison was a former staff sergeant in the Army National Guard. The family of the Utah native, which includes Cody, Robin, and Christine, was sat close to one another in pictures that were made public as they paid their respects. According to a source who spoke to the U.S. Sun, the family chose to memorialize their late relative by having Hunter, Robin, Christine, and Leon wear Hawaiian-inspired clothing as a sentimental thing between the kids. Rather than dressing in a floral print like his ex-wife Robin, Cody, who had a turbulent relationship with Garrison for years, opted to wear a pink dress shirt and blue jacket with trousers. His choice of clothing was made because, according to a source who spoke to the U.S. Sun, he was in mourning. The insider disclosed, Cody didn't feel like parading around in a colorful wardrobe. Fans of Sister Wives knew that Garrison and his father had not been in communication since the outbreak. They were still estranged and never made up prior to his passing, according to the U.S. Sun. I don't think they had even spoken since COVID times, a source revealed. Honestly, I can't even remember the last time they saw each other. The source went on, I know for a fact there was no buddy slash buddy hangout or friendship. On the day when the startling news was revealed, Cody commented on Instagram, despite the distance between him and Garrison. Cody wrote in the captions of two old pictures of Garrison, Janelle and I are deeply saddened to announce the loss of our beautiful boy Robert Garrison Brown. He brought joy and happiness to everyone he came into contact with. Our loss will leave a void in our life that is so immense it will leave us speechless. Janelle posted the identical pictures and caption on her social media. According to reports, Sister Wives Season 19 will depict what happens after Garrison's terrible death. Sister Wives, given Garrison Brown's passing, TLC ought to axe the show in 2010, Sister Wives introduced fans to the polygamist lifestyle of the Browns. A functional family consisting of several wives, numerous children, 
and one husband was intended to be the focus of the TLC series. In the end, it revealed the contrary. Cody Brown's father lost contact with several of his adult children, and three of his wives left the family. But now is the perfect time for TLC to axe the show, as it enters its 19th season and the Browns deal with the sorrow of Garrison Brown's confirmed suicide. The passing of Garrison Brown highlights the potential devastation that can come to families when someone's life is shared with the world. This detrimental effect was evident in a text message that Garrison sent prior to his passing, which worried his mother, Janelle Brown. According to TMZ, Garrison texted a group of individuals who the Brown family probably works with, possibly the TLC crew. The note said, I want to hate you for sharing the good times, Janelle told the police. However, I am unable to. These are the days I miss. Garrison probably made reference to growing up on sister wives, in front of his siblings. Over the years they spent on reality TV, the family went through many happy and sad occasions. But if the text that made Janelle worry is any guide, Garrison Brown had trouble adjusting to life on screen. He expressed to production that he wished for better days. Private disputes between parents and children are not usually shown to the public, yet on Sister Wife, Cody Brown was seen fighting openly with his wife and older children. The majority of its original goal has been abandoned. The Browns have given up polygamy, the majority of the members have left the Apostolic United Brethren, and Sister Wives now seems to focus more on family strife than happiness. There was nothing Garrison Brown and his siblings could do but appear on television. TLC purchased the Brown family as a package and tracked them for a period of 14 years. As a result, the Brown children worked alongside their parents without immediately benefiting from it. The majority of child performers on TLC shows are reportedly unpaid, and if you begin as a kid actor and work your way up through the network, it may be difficult to later negotiate your own compensation. 2010 saw the premiere of Sister Wives and Cody founded Cody Brown Family Entertainment, LLC. But since each person operating under that name had a contract with the company, TLC had no obligation to make sure they were all fairly rewarded. Cody was in charge of covering all of his kids' on-camera expenses. Michael T. Padron said on her Patreon page that over the 18 seasons of filming the TLC show, she never received payment. As a result, after they turned 18, many of the Brown children ceased appearing on camera and were forced to bargain for their contracts with the network or their father. The network paid the five adults in the series personally. Given that children's life change with marriage, having kids, and developing relationships, letting your kids' lives determine ratings is probably a wise business decision for the parent. But when do reality TV shows become a burden to family dynamics, as with Garrison Brown's case? Garrison hasn't been afraid to open out about his feelings on camera in the past few years about his family, especially his connection with his father, Cody Brown. Garrison, his sister Savannah, brother Gabe, Janelle Brown, Christine Brown, and Gwendolyn Brown got together in season 19 to talk about how they felt Cody Brown left them for Robin Brown. You know what, Robin, have him, Garrison remarked. Since we are all grown adults, we no longer require a father figure. The final time Garrison and Gabriel were saw on camera with their father was in season 17. Cody and his sons got into a fight about his stringent COVID-19 regulations. They believe Robin is the main focus. What do you think? It's about them not caring about other people, Cody remarked. Who else is making up these rules or not communicating well other than dad? Garrison shot back.